everybody, True Divine RPG with TJ the Obscure. I am pretty much right where I left off. Figured I would dig down, try to find a deeper cave, because I want to check out some of these guys that spawn at like the level, at like diamond level and stuff. If you're unfamiliar with the mod, you can see some of these creepy guys. And what do you know, like literally, like that's where I blocked myself off. I dug down and I happened upon a mine shaft. So we shall see what this place has to offer. Uh, once again, most of the mobs that I'm going to encounter down here uh, can one-shot me, pretty much. So, and this is in hardcore. I haven't messed around with the UH, UHC thing yet. Just been a little uh, swamped lately. Lots and lots of work. Uh, let's go ahead and block that guy off. Uh, boop. Boop, 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 boop. Oops, Cyclops. Um, so that's good, because he can't touch me, I don't think, uh, though they do throw projectiles. Um, I mean, he's too tall to fit through there, so I don't have to worry about him being able to melee me. I'm not even sure if they do melee, to be honest. Uh, let's see if I can defeat him. Yes? Whew. Okay, and these guys drop... Uh, in fact, most of these these guys will drop um, decent loot, uh, and sometimes you can, they'll drop ores. They'll drop like rare rare ores and whatnot. My main objective right now, of course, is to uh, get diamond, because I want to get enchanted as soon as possible. Um, and whatnot. Uh, what's up, dude? Uh, not right now while I'm recording, but once I'm done recording, we can play some together, alright? Okay. I'll be Kirby. Okay. Alright. Um, so, yeah. And some of them spawn even in light, I'm pretty sure. So, uh, even when it's lit up like this, I will see spawns. Um, so, my usual approach, running through these things, is probably not going to work very well. Let's just block that guy off. Uh, yeah, but blocks are going to be my biggest friend here, I do believe. Uh, nothing that way. Hello. Another Cyclops. Let's go ahead and block that off. Yes. Oh, gosh. What did I do? What did I do? What did I do? I jumped so bad, I hit, I hit, I somehow I pulled up chap. I have no idea how I did that. So he can clearly hit me from there. Let's see if I can get close enough to place a block. Uh, but you see, he did about four, four or five hearts or so. I do believe. Uh, let's hide behind the sign. Oh, oh, oh. Um, can we do this, maybe? Gosh. Watch out, huh? Ah yeah, ah yeah, 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 yeah. There we go. That's what I want. That stuff. Um, it's pretty much like the next grade up from iron. Real might is what it's called. Uh, so that's like the next step. And there's some real might ore. Very nice. I hear lava as well. Uh, boom. A uh, boom. Uh, so I'll go ahead and make. Some of this, I do believe. Um, so yeah, maybe what I'm not looking for is diamond. And what I want is real might. I think that's the goal. Uh, let's go ahead and oop, get some of this stuff for cooking. Uh, will that be? That'll be nine. I can make pants and a sword. Huh. You know what I should be doing? Because I have two arrows, which is not much, but it'll always help you in a pinch. Uh, is making a bow. Alright. Uh, so yeah, more caving. I may cut some of this out. Um, oh, hello. Uh, well, we'll just ignore that iron for now. And yeah, maybe a trip to the nether this episode. Maybe not. I also want to start building a base. Um, none of my other series get I get to show off my building. 
And it's not that I'm that proud of it or anything, but I don't get to build, and I do enjoy building. And this uh, mod does offer some new blocks to build with. Not all of them are that pretty. And this is an older mod, you know, so I don't have all the cool things that some of the newer mods have. Uh, but, you know, there's, there's still lots of stuff, as you can see. Uh, so, I do plan on setting up a base. Not sure how I want to do that yet. If I want to do, like, an above-ground base, or maybe... Uh, Something sounded like it was moving really fast right there. Let's block that guy off, please. Um, what do I want to make? I guess I'll go ahead and make a sword. Uh, just so you can see the difference in attack damage. Oop. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, gosh, there's... there's. Yeah, something is moving really fast behind me. Um... Oh wait, no, I didn't want to do that. I don't want I don't want the sword. Uh how do I get out of this? Been a while since I played a mod, you guys. So uh yeah. No, I want cheat mode. We want recipe mode. There we go. Oh gosh, I need two real might blocks just to make a sword. Yeah. Yeah. All right, gonna take a little while to do that, I'm sure. Uh, I hear this guy walking over this way. I do think. No. I might just be hearing the bat. Am I hearing the bat? Whew. I had class today that I taught. I teach an eight to twelve Saturday class. That's fun. Oop, my bad. Get a lot of older students, uh, a lot of working class students. Well, pretty much all of my students are working class. Um, it's a community college, but you know what I mean. Yes? All right. Good there. Let's head back in this direction. I swear there's a bat around here somewhere. I don't know where, though. Gosh, I'm real paranoid about something sneaking up on me. There's stuff all around me. That sounds like it's above me. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Alright, well, that's just a zombie. Oh, it's one of these guys. I don't think they're hostile. Uh, to be honest, I mean, the Cyclops is, but I don't think that guy's hostile. What are you? Yeah, and he has a thousand HP, so I don't think I even want to try to take him on. Uh, but I do want these Cyclopses. Hello! Mr. Can we just do... No. Um, yeah, that's what I want to do. Here, I'm going to go inside the wall. Inside the wall. Oh! Gosh, I don't know why. I'm shooting him like an Enderman. Like, if I look at him, he's going to all of a sudden attack me. You're scaring me, guy! There we go. Don't do it. Okay, I don't think he can hit me. Hey, come back! Come back! Uh, wait. Did that guy just kill that guy? You killed You killed your friend, dude! Oh, gosh, he can definitely hit me there. Why would you kill your friend? Why? Um, so a lot of the combat does take place like this, but not all of it. Once I have real might armor, I'll feel a lot safer taking this stuff on. Um, but until then, just, yeah. Just, yeah. Ah, yeah. Another one of the jack jackomans. 
Alright. Eat. Alright, this is supposed to be a talkie. Talkie series. Tyler, talk. Talk about things. What's going on in your life? I taught a class today. Uh, my students don't read any of the things I assign to them. Which I expect. And I live with. I didn't get into teaching to, uh, to force people to do things. And I don't think the role of a teacher should be to punish students. It should always be about helping them. And if they choose not to do the work, well, I will try my best to convince them of its value. I will not ever punish a student for not doing it. I don't feel like that is my role. Um, yeah. We're doing stuff related to class in America. Actually, they decide on the topic. I use like a like an anthology, uh, which is like a bunch of different essays and stuff. And then they choose. It has like you know like eight different topics, and they get to choose what they want to they want to read and write about. I swear the creepers are harder. Do the creepers always take four shots with an iron sword? I feel like it's three shots now, isn't it? This way? Anybody? More real might. Very nice. Stuff above me. I'm I think I could have sworn I was at like level 12 already. Or whatever. And how do I not have a freaking bucket yet? Uh, what else? What else? Afterwards, we went to birthday party. Uh, for my nephew. Uh, I hate birthday parties. Not just little kids' birthday parties. I sound like such an old curmudgeon. I really do. <laughs> I don't like anybody celebrating. I don't know. Um, just not a big... Big party kind of guy. What do I want? Torches? Yes. Torches, I guess. Uh, voila. This makes me very nervous, because we are on level 12 now, and this is where I'm bound to see a lot of the really, really hard mobs. Um, thankfully, there's plenty of real might. Oh, gosh! Why? Why? Oh, you know, there's also these things called, um, ender spiders. Which are really, really freaking, they're like endermen, but they're spiders, and they're small. And they're really freaking dangerous. Alright. Uh, I need to go and make a bucket. Stay away. And start mining this real might and whatnot. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. I will make sure to record. And if anything else crazy happens, I will include it. Stay away, Jack O' Lantern Man! Alright, uh, so it is like the next day. <laughs> My wife showed up and I had to stop recording momentarily. Well, not momentarily, and until the next day, I guess, is the more accurate thing. I need blocks. I should not be going anywhere without the blocks. Gosh, this cave is pretty crazy. Seems to go off in every which direction. Oh, I guess I can see it on my map there, huh? I'm really not used to playing modded Minecraft whatsoever. Uh, I did try to get the UHC mod, but... Apparently there isn't a version after 1.4.5. So this mod is in 1.4.7, which means we won't be able to do UHC. Uh, but that's okay. Doing this in hardcore is probably crazy enough. To be honest. 
Thing guy. Um. Oh, don't. don't do that. Do not do that. Uh, but yeah, my my wife's uh, grandpa is having problems and will most likely pass here pretty soon. They're pretty much just taking him home where he can be a comfortable uh, heart failure is the cause, typically the cause. Uh, her grandma died last year. Uh, so it's pretty pretty normal for you know the spouse to pass soon soon after, uh, but it doesn't make it any easier just because you were expecting it. Place is very very spooky. Um, See, so yeah, she's off doing that. I don't really handle death. It's not like I don't handle it well. I need coal. Um, I just don't really handle it, I guess you might say. <laughs> uh, in the sense that, I don't know, when somebody passes, I don't really have much of a reaction usually. Um, I'm trying to think I think like the earliest experience I had was my grandma on my dad's side, uh, and I remember my mom coming in and telling us, and my brothers and I, we all shared a room. I have two brothers, both older, and like they started crying, and I was just kind of like, you know. Well, I was young, for one thing, so maybe I just didn't really understand what was going on. That's why I didn't have much of a reaction. Not really sure. Uh, but other than that, like, you know, I remember my other grandpa dying, and nothing much. And I remember, like, my childhood dog dying, and, yeah. I guess that kind of sort of made me sad. Um, but my, my grandma, who I was actually kind of close to, she passed... It's been a couple of years now, I think, and uh, I don't know, I guess I was just kind of, it's like I knew that it was going to happen, especially because she had been in the hospital for a long time. Oh, look, there's one of those ender spiders. Oh, gosh. Um, so long as I don't look at it, I think I'm safe. That's the way that it works. Same way that the endermen work, yes. Probably should be grabbing iron. I'll do that off camera though. We're looking for the good stuff. We are looking for the good stuff. Please? Yes? I guess I'll go up here. Yes, go down. Down deeper into the caves. Alright. Um, I'm trying to think. I haven't really had anybody super close to me die, though. Yeah, my, my grandma, but we weren't that close. Uh, when I started going to school, she actually lived in the same city. And so, um, yeah, she would often help me out, have me over for dinner, that kind of stuff. Or I would help her out with things around the house. And we were able to chat, and she, you know, talked to me about uh, my family, and, and it was really cool to have that opportunity I, you know, a lot of people don't get to speak to their relatives on that level. Um, especially, like, a lot of the older guys. I can never imagine talking to one of my grandpas about stuff like that, but... <clears throat> very closed off. Probably not true for all grandpas, I'm sure. Um, yeah, but she told me about... Oh, gosh. Ah! You guys scare me. Uh, the Dust Bowl and coming over to uh, Western states um, when their farm failed and my grandpa working the farms and, and all that lovely stuff. Is that from me? Did I place that there? Just go ahead and do that. And what do we have? 
Stay away, guy. Just a regular old spider, huh? Hello. Uh, the one experience that I can think of that maybe... Uh, like, like, it was... It, nobody died, but it was the thought of death was uh, my son... He was about two years old at the time, and we were living in a house. I was still in school. We had a roommate. Uh, this was this girl. I'll, I have to. Whew, man, I have to talk about her. On a, on another video. Uh, there's a lot of stories with her. But um, I had this roommate, and she was supposed to be watching my son. Right? I was. I had. I had to run to the store to to do some shopping, and so our roommate had uh, a, a son and who was about a year and a half older than mine. So she had like the two-year-old and then the three-and-a-half-year-old, right? Um, so I leave to go to the store, and I'm like, you know, with my with my shopping cart, and oh, I don't want to hit him with my pick. And uh, going along, and she calls me, and she just says, oh, I can't find Will. Burn, skeleton. Can I really just dump lava on you and you'll die? I really want to do that. I need to eat. Uh, let's eat some spider eyes. Uh, and she, anyway, she calls and tells me I can't find Will. Will is my son's name. Uh, and I'm just like, what do you mean you you can't find him? She's just like, I don't know. Like, like I came out of my room and the the door was open, the front door was open, and and he's gone, and I'm just like, boom, you know, I drop everything, rush out of there. I almost end up getting into a car accident on the way home, because I'm rushing like crazy, you know? And, uh, right before I show up, she calls back, and she says, thankfully your neighbor found him. And he had apparently wandered into their backyard. Uh, this was the neighbor across the street, by the way. So my two-year-old son walked across the street. It's not a, it wasn't a busy neighborhood. It was a nice neighborhood. Um, and was by their pool playing with the dog. And my neighbors were really cool, cool people. So nothing, you know, they were... But man, just the thought of that, that he was missing, that something could have happened to him. <clears throat> I think that's the one moment where I've come really close to maybe experiencing what some people experience as far as uh, losing a, a loved one goes. Um, but my wife, man, when she when she loses somebody, uh, even her grandma, who she didn't really care that much for, not that she didn't care much for her, but her grandma was kind of a very opinionated um, woman who, who who wouldn't mind giving you advice, you know. Um, but, yeah. <laughs> like, when she died, like, my, my wife broke down in tears. And I have a hard time processing that. Like, those really intense emotional reactions, because I just don't... It's just not the way I work. Well, uh, I'm trying to keep these videos shorter. Oh, for diamond, yes. Yes, what we do need, even though I may not want diamond armor, I still need an enchanting table. We have room. No, just one. Such a tease, Minecraft. Such a tease. Uh, so I'm thinking these videos are probably going to be like once every three, four days. Uh, definitely not going to be as regular as my other videos. Uh, especially because in the future they'll require a lot more editing with me building stuff and whatnot. Um... So, but that's what I'm going to aim for. And I'm also going to try to keep them a bit shorter than most of my other videos. About 20, 30 minutes long, that kind of thing. Which means this video must come to an end. Alright, well, uh, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Uh, next episode, hopefully I can get geared up. I think I may skip more of the caving. Uh, and just include some highlights and stuff. Uh, and maybe next episode we'll do some building. I'll, I'll start to scope out a place to set up a base. 
Although this ravine is looking tempting, but then again, yeah, because things can spawn in the light, so I don't want to be down down here. Yeah, I, I think I have to build above ground. Anyways, anyways, uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed. I will see you next time.